Welcome everyone to our 10 minute overview of how to claim your cloud migration trial. My name is Will Howard McKinney, and I'm on a team here at Atlassian that focuses on helping folks navigate their Atlassian journey. We help brand new Atlassian customers, as well as those looking to expand their Atlassian footprint, including those who are planning a migration from on-premise into the Atlassian cloud. In this video, we will cover what a cloud migration trial is, how to claim it, and why it's such a helpful tool for our existing on-premise customers as you strategize your migration into the Atlassian cloud. Atlassian is investing more heavily than ever in our cloud platform, and we're excited to help our on-premise customers enjoy the benefits of running in the cloud, including reduced infrastructure cost, zero downtime upgrades, and a variety of plans that are designed to grow and scale with your organization as your needs change. We've found that our customers use cloud migration trials in several ways on their migration journey. Many customers use their migration trial as a way to tour the cloud, to test differences in functionality, and to try out new features. It can also be used as a great proof of concept for migration, to set up some initial projects, or build your business case with internal stakeholders. And it can be a great test environment where you can run multiple test migrations in a full production environment with no limitations. We highly recommend this as running the migration a few times in advance of a production migration will help ensure that final migration is seamless and ready for your folks to continue their work. And of course, you can use this cloud instance as your eventual production instance as well. We have a ton of incredible resources and support for our customers migrating into the cloud, including a free cloud migration trial for our on-premise customers to use for their migration. To check out those other resources, support, and tools for your migration, please visit atlassian.com slash migration slash cloud. There you will learn about our migration support team, our network of solution partners, step-by-step -step migration guides, and tons more to help you on your migration journey. And to reach my team directly, please contact us at presales at Atlassian.com. Both this link and this email address should be listed below the video along with any other resources mentioned. A cloud migration trial is an offer specifically for our existing on-premise customers. It provides you with a cloud license at zero cost for the remaining duration of your current maintenance period, up to potentially a full 12 months of a no-cost cloud license to use as the destination for your migration to the cloud. Now, regardless of how much time you have left on your current maintenance period, you will get at least 60 days of your cloud trial. And even if you are not under an active maintenance plan, we are still fully committed to your cloud migration, and you will still receive 60 days for this no-cost trial. Just know that we are committed to your migration to the cloud, and if you have any questions about the migration license or any of these other tools or resources, please reach out to us at presales at Atlassian.com. This license is a fully functional cloud instance. It's not feature limited or otherwise restricted, and you have the option to select either a standard or a premium license. Now, since there is no cost associated with this license for some time, I would recommend selecting a premium license to explore even more benefits to how your teams can collaborate and deliver work. But the decision is entirely yours to make. Premium plans come with several benefits, like 99.9% .9 financially backed uptime, 24-7 premium support, IP allow listing, and unlimited storage, just to name a few. So this is a really great opportunity to check out the benefits of running on premium. There are two ways that you can easily check your current maintenance period and spin up a cloud migration trial that we're going to look at. One is through my.atlassian.com, and the other is through atlassian.com slash getcloud. From my.atlassian.com, I'm already logged in here, so I'll just take a look at the licenses that I'm managing. And in this column to the right, I can see very clearly that it shows me when my maintenance period will end for these various licenses. So if I were to claim this now for Jira Software, I can see that I would have this no-cost cloud trial that would last until the end of October 2021. You can use this information to strategize when you'd like to begin your cloud migration, getting up to 12 months if you claim it shortly after a maintenance period renews. And remember, if your maintenance period expires within 60 days, you'll still get a full 60 days on your cloud migration trial, and you'll get 60 days even if you are not under an active maintenance plan. So now that we know when our maintenance period ends and have made a strategic decision on when we want to begin our migration, to claim the cloud migration trial, let's go ahead and expand this license for Jira software by clicking here. And we see we have info about the cloud migration right here. You'll see that my migration is set to 100 users. That's to match the current tier of my existing license. Yours should reflect a user limit that matches that of your specific license. So if you have 500 users on your Jira on-premise instance, you'll have a cloud migration trial for up to 500 users, for example. Now we also have this learn more link where you can find additional information about the cloud migration license, as well as information about the other tools and resources that we have to aid in your migration. 
To claim your cloud migration license, simply click here. And more than likely, you're going to select Start a New Site. There are some edge cases where you'll want to use an existing site, the most common being that you've already created a free or a trial cloud site that you want to use, but by and large, you'll be starting a new one. Only free and trial licenses can be used for this purpose. Any existing cloud license that has been paid for is not eligible. Now, the other common situation where you'll select an existing cloud site is when you're claiming additional cloud migration licenses for other Atlassian products. Jira and Confluence, for example. You'll start a new site when claiming your Jira cloud migration license and then select that same cloud URL later when you go through the same process for Confluence. Now on Atlassian.com slash get dash cloud, we'll start by clicking activate your free cloud migration trial. And this is nice because we're only presented with our eligible licenses. Whereas before we saw our existing cloud licenses, some expired trials and such, here we only see the on-premise licenses eligible for a cloud migration trial. Now, you'll notice that the expiration dates for JIRA and Confluence are different. JIRA expires in October 2021, and Confluence expires in November 2021. The dates the product remains no cost in your cloud license will always correspond to the expiration date of the original product. In this case, I'll be asked for payment information for JIRA Cloud in October 2021, but I won't be asked to pay for Confluence Cloud until November 2021. So we'll select one. We'll start with JIRA Software and click Activate Trial. And we're taken to the same interface we saw earlier, where this time we'll proceed with the activation. And just like that, your cloud instance is up and running and ready to be used as the destination for your migration. To add other products to that cloud migration trial, we simply return to where we were before and select the other product that we want to claim. We can see Jira software is now under activated trials, but Confluence is still eligible. So I'll click here, click activate trial. And we're back at this familiar page where this time we will select the cloud URL that I just made for Jira software. And now we have both of these products running in the same cloud instance, unlocking all the integration benefits and establishing the products we need in our cloud site so it's ready to receive our cloud migration data. So hopefully that shows how quick and easy it is to understand when your maintenance period ends, how to claim your cloud migration trial, and how to claim it strategically to get the most out of it as you manage your migration. Now, as you navigate your migration journey, we know this can seem like a lot, but we've taken great effort to provide you with incredible resources and information that help you every step of the way. So let's take a look at Atlassian.com slash migration slash cloud to see what we have to offer. Here we see the journey broken into several smaller phases, each with their own specific steps. And as you click into these various phases, you'll see those steps detailed out for you. This should really help you plan and strategize your migration. Now, we also have a list of valuable support, resources, and tools that will prove helpful along the way as well. So let's go over these quickly and see what we have available. Under support, we see that we have our migration support team who help with questions and guidance regarding your migration strategy and execution. We also have a global network of solution partners. These are third-party organizations that specialize in Atlassian tools who can lend more hands-on, more one-to-one -one support through your migration and beyond. And we also have the Atlassian community where our users share questions, answers, and best practices. Under resources, we have our migration guide and documentation to help with your migration. We also have Atlassian University to help you get the most out of our cloud products. And under tools, we see the cloud migration trial, which we've covered here, along with the cloud migration assistance. These are free apps that we've built to easily migrate your product data, users, and groups from server to cloud. And we have our app assessment, a feature within the migration assistant that analyzes the apps you're using and checks availability and parity of cloud versions. Further down, we have much more detailed info for folks going through a self-guided migration and info about the additional assistance we provide to folks migrating from larger 1,000 plus user instances. Now, I wanted to go over these because I want to underscore that we have your back every step of the way during your migration, including with this cloud migration trial, to give you plenty of time to handle your migration without incurring any additional costs of a cloud instance while you migrate from your on-premise version. And there you have it. Thanks, everyone, for taking the time to learn a bit more about migrating to the cloud and about our cloud migration license. And if you have any additional questions, please reach out to presales at Atlassian.com. Thanks very much, and happy migrating.